is uh, I love my social our social media director. Um, she tells me you're. I want you to do a reaction video. I'm not going to tell you much about it. I'm like, okay, I'm game. Let's do it. And uh, so at the end of the last video, um, I was like, I I'd like to see the other side of the you know the journey. All right, beautiful people, David Lovely, back again really quick. Um, ask and you shall receive. So just coming back, I'm the integrative therapist here at the Alma Clinic. If you haven't checked us out, if you don't know who we are, the Alma Clinic is, we're a functional and integrative medicine clinic in Lawrence, Kansas. And we have a few other providers, several other providers here with a very personalized approach who have also reacted to some other videos. And so I invite you to check out some of our other contexts, not only reaction videos, but there's also conversations that we have about things that maybe aren't in the, you know, the, the traditional or the, the quote unquote normal conventional way. And so we have a different way of doing things here. And it, it is, it's very personalized and we want to get to the root of whatever ailment that is so that we can optimize and actualize and be the best possible versions of ourselves that we can be mentally, emotionally, physically, spiritually, if that's where we are. And so we find great joy um, in the challenge, in the discovery, and also being a witness to people coming home to themselves and thriving. And so, um, yeah, I invite you into our space. Check out some of the other um, videos that we have in this channel. And also, if, if you enjoy this, these contents, keep liking, subscribing, and uh, offering us suggestions because um, we want not just our patients, our clients, our, our family to thrive, but we want collectively, society, humanity to thrive. And uh, what will that look like when we're all functioning optimally and actualizing who and what we really are and what we're here to do? So a um, little soapbox, but that's okay. You know what? I'm, I'm very passionate about what I do. And also, so asking you shall receive, coming back to that, is uh, I love my social, our social media director. Um, she tells me, you're, I want you to do a reaction video. I'm not going to tell you much about it. I'm like, okay, I'm game. Let's do it. And uh, so at the end of the last video, um, I was like, I I'd like to see the other side of the, you know, the journey on the healing. And so here she is. She's like, oh, don't you worry. I've got you. And so we're going to watch um, and react to Ren's power um, music video. And so again, this one, this one's short. And so a little caveat, I may watch it all the way and then respond unless something is like really gripping. Um, and I also might feel like, I don't know, moving. So we'll just see. We'll just see what shows up. Um, but let's go. <clears throat> mm. Get it. Uh. Power. <laughs> Don't play my shit, I never had a top ten Maybe it's cause I sing about violence and depression They say don't blame these kids, just focus on yourself, friend Well, if they don't like what I'm doing now, then fuck them Don't trip high up the ante, learning licks like John Fashanti Smoking spliffs and popping candy, idolizing Sid and Nancy Woo, rock and roll in my soul, bumping knocking cold On the dole, fish and chips and games consoles Council housed and violent flow but life went sweet at home Mum and dad took a trip and they split shalom What will be, will be but me I hate to see my mum alone Late night crying, get so high to try to silence Sounds of fighting through the walls I heard love dying mm. So I focused on my mm. That's what it was I focused on my Now let's go back Let's go back these kids don't play my shit, I never had a gold plaque My style is old school, but I swear this ain't a throwback I put my visions into rhythms on a dope track To understand the place I'm coming from, let's go back When I was 16, I was a sick teen, I was a victim of my head I was just 16, up in the kitchen, racking up lines till my nose bled 16, in an affliction, in an addiction with my dread I was just 16, I was quite sick then, I was a prick then, I was a pleb, but Fuck it, we're all misguided individuals, life can suck it. My cup ain't half full, man, I'm filling up the hole. 
bucket I'll drink my tears so I can drown my sorrow Sing like I might die tomorrow Live for the butter, 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 butter Note for note, I go for broke on every single song I wrote And every single song I write brings freedom to my weary mind A healing that you'll only find inside an intricate design Of kicks and snares and flat bass lines I flip the script until I find my... I focus on my Now run the track Run the track It's <laughs> fun Get it fun ah, very different message very different portrayal uh, and there's one lyric in there and, and forgive me I won't get it probably right um, but something like with each lyric or each song that I wrote there was in essence more freedom that's kind of what I took from that and that that stands out to me it's like when we take what's within and has been suffering and turmoil and pain and anguish and misery and anger and we instead of and these are my words and this is my interpretation you know instead of being a victim to that you know we we take the reins and turn that into and that's kind of what i take from him is like he in, in harness this inner power um to be able to transform and not only an inner power i mean not only again i'm not going to read into it too much not that he only did it himself but something greater than him perhaps helped him tap into that power and then use it as a a ways and means to extricate himself and uh you know have fun with it i mean it clearly having fun in that video it's it's, it's catchy it's dancey <laughs> you know some of the lyrics they are what they are you know and, and his uh i mean his choice of words he just has a way of letting it flow so um i don't think you can box ren in to uh, a particular genre or piece because everything that I've watched um, in the four videos now that I've, I've seen of him, uh, he's very eclectic. It, it, there's a, there's a skill set to him that you, you just can't say this is, this is what it is. Um, and all of us have this, this power, uh, this, and it too, it, it doesn't feel like it's an egotistical power of like, I'm, you know, going to, take charge and dominion over anyone else. It's like, no, this is going to take charge and dominion over my, my suffering, my struggles and shy. So I love that. I, I love that. I love seeing that. Uh, any of you who can experience that, I mean, I know personally, I, I have gone through my own trials and tribulations and will continue to go through trials and tribulations. But there's a, there's a, an amazing sense of like when you've been through something and when you've moved through it, like that, that doesn't leave you. It can nourish you. It can amplify you. It can traject you into whatever's next. And you, you have that resilience. You have that. I mean, I'm speaking you, let me personalize this. Like I have that within myself and I can use that. There's a reservoir of experience. There's a reservoir of, you know, yes, pain and suffering, but of resiliency and overcoming. And so it's fun to be on the other side of that and say like, wow, look what I went through. Look where I am now. Where do I want to go? What do I want to do with this? Um, you know, and to bring it first full circle back to what I was kind of talking about initially before the, the video, I guess I can take those off and <laughs> really hear myself, was like when we actualize imagine what that what that will look like feel what that will look like when we are thriving 
because I believe my my personal belief is it's not only a possibility; it's only a matter of time before we're doing it. And you know, in in our collective here, we we talk about that, and we 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 nourish each other, and we we push each other, we gently towards that, and sometimes greatly towards that. It's like, no, what is the best version of you? What does that look like? And who is going to be around you to make that happen? Those are the people I want to surround my life with. So, um, again, blessings, Ren. Keep doing what you're doing. You're making an impact, helping transform people into potentials and not only potentials, but reality. So yeah. Thanks for watching friends, folks, beautiful people. <laughs> we'll see you again. I'm sure. Mm. Beautiful.